If you haven't seen a banana spider, they're disgusting. And I grabbed it with my hand! I was a Girl Scout from kindergarten, the daisies where you start all the way up until seventh grade. Girl Scouts were a great time, but that all kind of changed with Girl Scout camp. To this day, my mom and I still call it the Girl Scout camp from hell. I was seven or eight years old. This was the middle of summer, a Girl Scout camp in North Texas. Very hot, very dry. I'm prone to nosebleeds, like a lot. During this week long camp, I got nosebleeds. I kid you not, like, 10 times a day. I'd get in the pool, nose start bleeding, have to get out of the pool. Go to the showers, nose starts bleeding. It was a mess. Another thing about the camp that sucked was the food. I remember getting tacos one night. Oh, everything was good and dandy, and next thing you know, we all got <laughs> diarrhea. As if this already wasn't the worst Girl Scout camp Ever, the mosquitoes ate me alive, and I'm not exaggerating. We were in this tent that only had a mosquito net around our bed, and the mosquito nets had lots of holes in them. I've never had that many mosquito bites in my life. They're all over my arms, all over my back, all over my legs. I remember every night, like, crying in my bed, and then having another nosebleed, and then crying some more. <laughs> when my mom finally arrived, it was the best day of my life. She lifts up the back of my shirt, and she just screams, because she's never seen so many mosquito bites in her life. She feels so bad for me. We go to Sonic, she gets me a slushie. A week later, I have this, like, rash down my chest, and this was the time of West Nile virus breaking out. So I got West Nile virus when I was eight from Girl Scout camp, and and nosebleeds and uh, diarrhea and um, lots of, you know, scarred emotions. <laughs> Growing up in Miami, we were around a lot of nature, so Girl Scouts in Miami was just the real deal. We went to a camp in Coral Gables called Camp Mahachi. Inside of this camp, they had this thing called Rock Garden, where you could go and just climb around these fossilized rocks. And just being a mischievous, just curious child, like a group of Girl Scouts and I snuck off during like our lunch break. We're like, we're gonna go run around the rock garden. And they had warned us before about these things called banana spiders. They're disgusting and it's so terrifying. Ugh! They create this giant webs. And I remember they had these huge yellow fuzzy legs. And I was walking around the rock jungle and I slipped on like a slimy rock and I tried to grab for something that I could hold on to, and my hand fell right into the banana spider's web, and I grabbed it with my hand! Ah! And the thing bit the center of my hand, and I had to like go to the nurse's office, and she was like, banana spiders are poisonous. <laughs> oh my god, I didn't come here for this. This is not the badge I was looking for. I was a Girl Scout probably from second or third grade till the end of eighth grade. It was a rumor that our troop leader actually stole the money from our cookie sales and put it towards her renovated house. We couldn't go to pony camp, which I was really upset about. The troop leader still was a troop leader, for a while longer. We just never really got down to what actually happened and it was never really addressed, although I complained about it a lot. If I could talk to that old troop leader now, I would say, not cool taking the money and I really hope that someday I can ride a horse.